Rob and Joss in the morning. Rob is actually the one holding the camera. Say hi, Rob. Hello. Oh, <laughs> freaky. Anyways, we're kind of here with, like, the whole family, and this is a very interesting thing that took place. Candy, can you tell us what happened last Sunday? Well, I had a baby shower for Jasmine. It was a lovely shower, got a lot of nice gifts. At the end of the shower, some of the people there decided to help and take the gifts out and put them in Jasmine's car. Unfortunately, they didn't put them in her car. They put them in the car next to hers in the trunk, and the person that was driving that car wasn't part of our shower. So they got in their car and drove off with all of her shower gifts. And uh, Candy brought this story to us, and we thought, wow, that's... That story is so crazy, it has to be real. <laughs> and really kind of a Christmas miracle has happened. We had several people who had had children or just had really big hearts who wanted to donate some stuff and give you another impromptu baby shower, Jasmine. Yeah. Thank you. And um, we'll try to make sure all the gifts get in the right cars this time. Yeah, <laughs> yeah darn straight we will. <laughs> Right. Jasmine, the expectant mom, really had no idea what was waiting for her down the hall behind closed doors. An impromptu baby shower thrown by women who had heard her story on Froggy 92.9 and wanted to open their hearts to help Jasmine and her baby. Behind this closed door may be some things that have replaced the tragic thing that happened with your baby shower gifts last Sunday. So are you ready? Yeah. Okay, I think she's a little nervous. They told, me, they told me Jasmine was a little nervous and a little shy. Is it okay yeah. if I reveal that? Yeah. Okay. How you feeling, Ivan? Are you okay? Yeah. Okay, Ivan's all right. <laughs> Rob went on into our conference room, a.k.a. baby shower room, where the ladies were waiting. All right. Um, so Jasmine, all of this is for you. Feel free to take what you need. If there's something you don't need or you'd like to pass along, we can give it to um, a woman's shelter here in Sonoma County. That was Peyton laughing over there. <laughs> Hooray for Peyton! And um, here's your new friends. We've got Kristen and Peyton. Hi, hi. We've got Karen, we've got Kayla, Trish, and Jasmine. And Erica donated some stuff, and she couldn't be here, but she donated some stuff like the um, bassinet that you wow, see her. We want to make sure, too, that... Um, this young man here isn't left out. Ivan, come with me, dude. And Ivan, how old are you? Seven. All right, Ivan. Seven? Are Let's... you here with your wife? No. <laughs> no. Okay. Okay. Let's follow Uncle Rob. This was given to us by a listener who dropped it by the radio station who said, when he was a little boy, he never got anything for Christmas, so he wanted to make sure this was passed on to a good place. Hey, go ahead, yeah. Go ahead. Rip it Rip open. It open. <laughs> Rip it open. It is a brand new bicycle! Oh <laughs> All right, so Ivan doesn't feel left out. You're very welcome. Now, Ivan, under I know that it's a bike in a box right now, and it needs to be put together, but you don't want Uncle Rob and Aunt Jocelyn putting things like this together, okay? <laughs> we did you a favor. You don't know, but we did you a favor. So that's from a nice man who stopped by to make sure a good kid like you got a good present. You guys, what inspired you guys to come on by and be a part of the uh, impromptu baby shower? Um, well, I'm a single mom, and um, no. oh, more crying. Oh, see, I didn't know this would happen. <laughs> and um, any like little bit will help, so I figured I would pass it on to somebody that really deserved it. Oh, thank you. thank you, Kayla, Trish, and Jasmine. Thank you, guys. Paint it forward. And, yeah, and Karen, you've been so cool because you were helping out with the Les Schwab toy drive. So what'd you bring today? A bunch of baby stuff. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good thing. It's a good stuff choice. that I had in the house for babies and stuff that I've collected to just give to somebody. 
for baby showers or whatever. Aw, thank you, Karen. And then over here, it's Kristen and Peyton. Hey, Peyton. Hey. You're going to be on a movie. How old right. are you, Peyton? 14 months. 14 months. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> and what inspired you to come by today and be a part of the impromptu baby shower? I think we just both of us felt like there was no reason not to. Yeah. <laughs> and that's how he felt about it. Yeah. <laughs> but we're so fortunate to have um, a lot of things for him with family and friends that there's no reason not to share. All right, Kristen. All right, and Candace, you've been such a good friend to Jasmine, and um, the baby's actually going to be named after you. Ew, this is baby Candace, and I'm just, like, honored beyond words. And Jasmine is just, she's my very best friend in this world. She she used to work for me, and when I first met her, I thought, oh, great, I work in mental health, and I thought, oh, great, they've hired a 12-year-old kid. And <laughs> the male patients are really going to be at her, and then I was just so impressed with how how strong she is and just the person that she is and we became fast friends and we're still fast friends there's nothing i wouldn't do for her <laughs>